everyone, today I'm coming to you from my front yard in Las Vegas and I thought I'd show you it's 120 degrees here outside in my front yard. And look around, you've got plants growing here that are fine. Why is that? Because they have something that's called chlorophyll. No matter how thin their leaves are, no matter how hot it is, they're fine. It's nature's sunscreen. Anyway, there are two plants growing here that are probably the most powerful healing plants on the planet. That's prickly pear cactus and aloe vera. You don't have to be in the desert with 120 degrees to have these things growing. People grow these up north where it's snowing. They grow them in their kitchen. They grow them in their living room. These two plants are truly amazing. There's different varieties of prickly pear cactus, but all varieties are edible. Those of you who watch my free food and medicine DVD set know that these little colorful Easter eggs on top are edible. But what a lot of people don't know is these Mickey Mouse ears are also edible. They're called pads. The entire plant is edible and it's been used for centuries. It has antiviral properties used for herpes, flu, HIV, obesity, gastrointestinal orders, cholesterol, and skin problems. These pink Easter egg type things, which is the fruit, they taste like raspberries and they're super high in antioxidants. So here's the inside of the uh, prickly pear fruit. You uh, eat the, all the flesh and you can swallow the seeds or you can spit them out just like uh, eating a watermelon. The, the reds mean high antioxidants. The reds mean high, high. These flat green pads contain a full range of amino acids, the building blocks of protein. It's an extremely rare for a plant source to have this many amino acids. It's very high in dietary soluble fiber, pectin, mucilage. Studies have shown that the prickly pear cactus has been very effective against diabetes, even type 2. Apparently it helps the pancreas create insulin. It's amazing. Aloe vera is one of the most amazing plants you can imagine. If you cut it, it heals itself. It actually heals itself. You can store it for months. It's a smart plant. It can tell the difference between the healthy cells, which it stimulates, and the bad cells, which don't belong, like cancer and things like that. And it helps stop the viruses from spreading. It's antibacterial, antiviral. It's used for candida, parasite, fatigue syndromes, fibromyalgia, allergies, arthritis, skin conditions like eczema, psoriasis. It eliminates toxic waste. It has essential fatty acids. And it's a powerful anti-inflammatory, which helps the colon and the stomach. It helps every Every part of the body cleanses itself. And since it helps clean out the bowels so well, it really helps cut down on bloating and gas and indigestion and all kinds of digestive problems. It's very popular for conditions like acid reflux and to irritable bowel syndrome, colitis, Crohn's disease, you name it. You can grow this indoor, outdoor, pretty much anywhere in the world you can grow this. It's actually been shown to reduce ulcers by up to 80%. It reduces cholesterol and triglycerides, it helps metabolize fat, and it's great for everything from adult diabetes to asthma to angina, blood sugar, cholesterol, acne, AIDS, anemia, arteries, athlete's foot, bad breath, hair loss, bladder infections, bronchitis, bruises, burns, cataracts, cold sores, colic, colitis, depression, epilepsy, multiple sclerosis, bursitis, glaucoma, and vision problems. There's really nothing better than this. It's it's really silly to run to the health food store, to the grocery store, to the pharmacy. It has all kinds of natural steroids, antibiotics, amino acids, minerals, enzymes, and stuff that I can't even get into yet. So anyway, I'm going to show you how to make something real quick and easy with this thing. It's just so easy, it's unbelievable. So aloe. Chop the thing into your Vitamix, and then you get your prickly pear. Now there's prickles on here. And uh, you can burn them off with a match or a lighter or something. I, I don't deal with that. I just get right to it. So you hold it with the tongs. Just cut it. Cut it into pieces. Stick it in the Vitamix. So now you've got bits and pieces of aloe and cactus in the Vitamix. Now this is really bitter because of all the power that it has and the sulfur and everything. So we need to sweeten it up a little bit. So we just get some orange juice here. Now I never suggest that anybody drink orange juice or any fruit juice straight. It concentrates the sugars too much and feeds the, the little critters, the yeast, the bacteria, the parasites inside you. Do not drink fruit juice straight. Now the aloe and the cactus are really high in fiber so that'll help slow down the absorption of the sugar so I'm not too worried about using this orange juice with the cactus. Just a couple oranges is all you need. And here we go with the Magic Vitamix once again. <laughs> Let's
let it run till it's a little bit warm. That way you kind of know you, you liquefied everything. Because I know a lot of you are thinking, oh no, what about the needles and those little sharp things that the cactus have? Well, the Vitamix seems to just like liquefy literally anything you put in there. But just to be safe, a really fine mesh nut milk bag which gives you peace of mind when you pour it out. Look how rich that is. That is super, super, super rich. That is green as heck. So now we pour our magic elixir into the nut milk bag. Squeeze it. Look at all that foam coming out of there. Just take your time squeezing it till it's all out. And that's it. Now, what's kind of interesting is when you look at the pulp, there's no needles, there's no sharp anything. Look at all the foam on top of this. That means there's a serious amount of enzymes and life force in this stuff. Oh, wow, that tastes so good and you just you can taste how good this is for you. If you want to know what real health is, you got to drink some of this. I drink it almost every day. And I have, <laughs> it's like the fountain, this is the fountain of youth. If you want to say goodbye to your problems, whatever they are, if you want longevity, here it is. I love you all. I'll see you next time.